Well, howdy friends, Brian Fleshig of Mad River Outfitters in the Midwest Fly Fishing Schools, and welcome back. And today we have a new product launch from our friends at Reddington. <laughs> So for many years, uh, the Reddington Path has been a big selling rod for us here at the shop. Uh, and you know, it, it had been a number of years, so it had kind of run its course. And so Reddington has replaced the Path series of rods with the new Wrangler. And we are super excited about these. Um, th there's no question, friends, and you'll see, we did some casting when these first came in uh, of course with the staff and you're going to hear from Pat Kelly and from Ryan Ratliff on these uh, Here in this video, but there is no question that the Reddington Wrangler rod for uh, a rod that's under 200 um, I hesitate to say the price because prices are always changing these days But they're well under $200 and you're just not going to find uh, a, a better made rod and a better casting rod for this kind of money uh, just no question. The Wrangler rods, they're sold two ways. Of course, you can buy just the rod itself. I think they come in 9 foot 4, 9, 5, 9, 6, 9, 7, 9, 8, and a 10 foot 7, um, which we'll talk about in just a second. Uh, but they're they're just fantastically done. I mean, they're, they're a performance, uh, a, a fairly high performance rod for the money, and they're medium fast actions, which is really what we want them to be especially for beginning casters. But they have a gloss gray finish with charcoal wraps. Uh, kind of reminds me, um, you know, I've seen these Toyota Tacomas uh, in this kind of matte gray color driving around. This kind of reminds me of that. And it's, it's a cool look for a fly rod. Um, it's kind of unique and a little bit different. So these also feature uh, anodized aluminum reel seats, which is also another feature that you don't often see on these lower price rods. These are good quality reel seats. They're not the cheap like pot metal stuff that's gonna bend or break on you or corrode over time. Um, they have very, very good. I'm really impressed with the quality of the cork handles on these. Um, and of course the lighter weights have the half wells and then the heavier weights have the full wells grip, okay, which um, gives you a little bit more to push on. And then they've even got these uh, accents back here on, on the cork. You know, they've got the accents on the cork there and accents here on the full wells and then, of course, on the fighting butt. So uh, they're very well done and uh, uh, you know, very impressed with the quality of the cork on these. They do have alignment dots. Okay, for those of you that can't figure out how to line up your, your guides properly, they've got the dots, which makes it easier, which is, in all honesty, a nice feature and good to have. Also, kind of another cool feature, they are laser etched on there, on the top of the reel seat, as per what line weight it is. So if you've got several rods uh, lined up, you can easily look down and identify what weight it is. And uh, they do come with a... Um, Cordura uh, PVC rod tube with the dividers on the inside. They do not come with a sack, but a good quality rod tube. So, um, and of course, they all feature both the rods and the kits, which I'm about to talk about, come with uh, the unconditional Reddington uh, lifetime warranty, which, heard me say it before, you will break this fly rod. It has nothing to do with Reddington or any manufacturer. You're just going to break this rod. And when you do, uh, you just go to Reddington's website. And uh, I believe these days they're actually going to send you a new part to it for, of course, a bench fee or call it a deductible. But anyway, I, I said I'd talk about the seven weight. Um, we've done a bunch of videos on steelhead fishing here in the Great Lakes region and here in the Lake Erie region. And I've told you on several occasions that my favorite steelhead rod was the Reddington Path. Okay, I, I don't typically use expensive rods for steelhead fishing. Well, uh, not only is the Wrangler my new favorite steelhead rod, uh, but they really improve the action on it. They, they kind of listen to us and uh, the action is even better than the path and it's and it's a better made rod 
There's no question. So uh, my new favorite steelhead rod is the 10 foot seven weight Reddington Wrangler. Um, so, so for those of you that do see that, the old videos where I talk about the path, the Wrangler is the new path. Let's, uh, let's head out, out back of the shop uh, where Pat Kelly and Ryan Ratliff and I had a chance to cast these rods. And Pat in particular had a lot to say about the nine foot seven weight. So Pat, you really love this nine foot seven weight in particular. It's fantastic. I mean, the, the, the industry was lacking a good bass rod under $200 and, and Reddington just knocked it out of the park with the Wrangler. That's the first thing that you said was when you cast this, you said, finally, we have a good bass rod for under $200. 100%. Yeah. yeah. It's, it did not disappoint and it just... And you've, you've thrown this rod with sinking lines, sink tips and, and... Yeah, it does a fantastic job. I mean, here we're throwing it with the, uh, the Rio Warm Water Predator and handles it like a dream. I mean, even right-handed, you're casting that well. It's pretty amazing. Yeah. Yeah. So, I mean, seriously, is there a better rod for under $200 or, you know, halfway between 100 and 200? No, this is the best I've ever seen. This, yeah. is, this is great, fantastic. Yeah. I, I agree, no question. Let me, let me cast that. Oh man, these these things throw these things throw loops. Seriously. So there you have it from Ryan and Pat, two of our most trusted associates here at the shop. And so let's head back into the studio and we'll talk about the kits, the Wrangler kits that Reddington's offering. The Reddington's uh, Wrangler are also available in a kit form. And I tell you, this is an exceptional value. Uh, you all know about the Reddington Field Kits and what big fans we are, but they're going to be about $100 or uh, even more uh, than the Wrangler Kits. So if you're looking to spend under $250 uh, on, on a kit, the Reddington Wrangler is going to be hard to beat. These are done a little differently than the rods. The rods are just by line weight. Well, uh, they've given these kits names. The 9 foot 4 weight is called the Pond. The nine foot five weight is called the trout, which uh, I think is a little deceptive because of course you can fish a nine foot five weight for a variety of species. So do, if you see the word trout, don't think it's just for trout fish. But they also make the nine foot six weight. They call that the trout XL. Again, that's kind of starting to get into smallmouth and light duty largemouth in, in my world. So. It's just a nine foot six weight. They happen to call it the Trout XL. Then they make the bass kit, which is a nine foot seven weight. They make a salmon kit, which is the nine foot eight weight. And they make a saltwater kit, which is also a nine foot eight weight. It just happens to come with a saltwater capable fly line. Now, um, the fly lines that come with these are an upgrade as to most kits. They're not premium hundred dollar fly lines but they are decent quality fly lines that uh, you should not feel that you have to replace right away. Um, and they do come with the new version of the Reddington Crosswater Reel. Now, in all fairness, this is a composite reel, but I tell you, for, for what it is, a composite reel that I think sells for, uh, again, I hate to mention prices, but today, in 2023 it sells for $64.99 and if you're looking to spend well under $100 for a fly reel take a look at this this thing kind of modeled after their legendary behemoth fly reel this is a heck of a fly reel and I mean to tell you for those of you that are just average Joe average Jane um, and yes the salmon kit the saltwater kit they come with this crosswater reel and it's very, very well made for a composite reel. It snaps together kind of like the behemoth. And as with most fly reels these days, it has a stronger drag system than you need. There's no question that drag system is more than you're going to need. Maybe with the exception of salmon or saltwater, 
Um, but regardless, it's a composite reel, but absolutely nothing wrong with it. Uh, in fact, if you're again, if you're in the market for a reel under a hundred bucks, check out the Redding, the new Redding from Crosswater. These things are excellent. So the kits come with the Crosswater reel, the rod, and a good quality mid-price Rio fly line that's uh, of course matched to the rod. And of course, the kits also carry the unconditional, excuse me, Reddington lifetime warranty. And again, that's very important. Uh, for anybody, not only for beginners. So, by the way, this fly line comes with a welded loop on the end, which a lot of the kits in this price range don't. A lot of your beginner kits don't. So, if, especially if you're a beginner or an intermediate angler for that matter, we're not going to ask you to tie a nail knot or a snell knot to put your leader on. A simple loop to loop connection is all you need, uh, like I said, especially if you're a beginner. And it does come with a decent quality leader, not just some junk. And they actually tell you, you can look on a website as to what size leader comes with the kit. Again, that doesn't normally happen. So there you have it. We are big fans here. Reddington, thank you. Um, you've really done entry-level anglers and those that don't want to break the bank to get good equipment. You've done us all a big, huge favor. Um, and the Reddington Wrangler rods, uh, no question, uh, best rod on the market uh, in their price range, which is uh, right about halfway between 100 and 200. So, uh, as always, friends, uh, you can check all of this out at MadRiverOutfitters.com. Uh, we've got plenty of the Reddington Wrangler products in stock as well as the new Reddington Crosswater Reels. So if you're looking to get decent quality equipment that's going to work well for you and is covered by a guarantee, check out the Reddington Wrangler. So as always, friends, we appreciate the support. Remember, we need you in order to continue to do this. We don't have sponsors that pay our bills. So uh, we count on your all support here at Mad River Outfitters. And of course, we really appreciate it. If you have any questions, you can shoot your questions over to admin at madriveroutfitters.com. We answer emails virtually 24 hours a day, or better yet, pick up the phone and you, we'll answer it. I promise you, if, if we're open, which we're always open, except when we're closed. So as always, thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel, that helps us out. Hit the like button, that just makes us feel good. And stay tuned, we've got a lot of great fly fishing content coming your way. And oh, by the way, watch this video here, and watch that video here, and thanks again.